Actually, we have more than 5,000 employees in our service. I will daily deliver 200,000 niche boxes. That means we are doing 400,000 transactions every day. In within just two to three hours, we cover the most 120 kilometer of Mumbai. But we are not using any type of technology. There is no any technology no mobile phone, even no any paper transactions. How these 5,000 people can deliver almost more than 200,000 niche boxes within four hours? Because there is no any written information on paper. There is no any applications. There is no any website. But for when the get delivered, when the box get delivered, almost three to four people they involved in what transactions. Welcome back, everybody. In the world where science and technology is booming, where generative AI applications have completely flooded the entire market, where digitization is taking over almost all the fields, where people are afraid of AI taking over their jobs, we will be deep diving into one such case study, which is an epitome of how, without using technology, how just by using simplicity, teamwork, time management, and coordination, one can use human resources to completely disrupt the entire supply chain. How, without using technology, one can conquer the food delivery system of Mumbai. One such case study, which is an example that is being researched by prestigious organizations such as the IITs and even foreign institutions such as the Harvard Business School. One such case study, which is Six Sigma certified, that means Having an error rate of 1 in 16 million, we will be looking at one such case study, which is of the Dabba Valance. When it comes to making use of technology in food delivery, there are two big players that come to our mind. One is Swiggy, the other is Zomato. Usually, their employees make use of Google Maps to track the restaurants and the delivery address. But in case of Dabba Valance, without technology, how do they keep track of which house do they have to pick up the difference from and to which place do they have to deliver? Do they have their own coding system? So we see the whole us, they they set their time management, like they set their own supply chain because you all know Mumbai is a very big city, is a bit of the uh, there are various stations in Mumbai. So we only take the numbers, alphabets, other combinations to develop the coding system. We have our own coding system, which is not scanned by the scanner, which is scanned by the eyes, because I our eyes is the big scanner. Our head is computer and our white cap is a first door, which because this is working as a GPS for us. In 100 meter in the pine by the all art, okay, he's standing over there and then connect with it within 10 seconds. This human technology we are using in the system. We don't have any QR code, no any barcode code systems to send up ourselves. We the oil paint colors we use, we just add these oil paint colors on the uh, top of the dish box. We add some numbers and other color combinations which we use to understand about the customers. We can't imagine. We just add only four codes over there. So with the four code, we understand who will be this not this dish box, what will be the peak port, how we station. East called West. So last, lastly, the let's watch with is where is to be a get delivered. The destination part also we mentioned here. The second of all, I mean, first of all, I mean, again, I hit this building, Chandrabha is going to be a get delivered. And finally, on, on which floor, the floor code is also we mentioned here. How the food delivery applications usually work is that we have a mobile phone to which we place the order to a restaurant and one of the nearby delivery agents is contacted who then goes to the restaurant, takes the order, takes the parcel, delivers it to our home. And then we complete the transaction by either paying directly by cash or through online payment. So this is usually the system that is followed in case of these delivery apps which make use of technology. But Dabawalas, how do they make use of their system in order to make sure that the package is delivered to the right person and that too in time without any mess up? Actually, our supply chain is totally working out how it's for board. We have directly collection boxes from multiple homes. We come together at the uh, 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 sorting, sorting area. We sorted the last boxes that's got the destination, and we again start by traveling to the local trends. We reach at the destination point. And once we reach at the destination point, we again on the wallets they come together, they again sorted the last boxes, and we go for the final thing. So, mostly all in the wallets, we use bicycles to collect the last boxes from the houses. After that, we use local train for the long distance, and finally, we use hand car, which is hard guard, we use for the last day of the week. Analyzing uh, tennis of Surani or electricity, no driver to be done. Even no uh, any paper, no plastic, no technology. So no pollution, even no radi uh, radiation, you can say. One of the reasons why the Bawalas are so successful in Mumbai is because the local trains are laid out in such a way that it connects major stations, making it easy for the Dabawalas to plan out their journey in order to carry more tiffins or more Dabbas. And this makes it more cost efficient, as well as since you rightly mentioned that they are making use of public transport cycles, they are more economical. So cost efficiency and economics is something that is taken care of. 
बट अनदर एस्पेक्ट ऑफ डब्बा वाला इज देर रिलायबिलिटी दी कस्टमर्स ट्रस्ट द डब्बा वाला अलॉट हाउ डू यू मेक श्योर दैट दिस ट्रस्ट इज मेंटेन is there a certain selection procedure that you keep in mind while selecting your employees so there are various where our is uh, that food industry are there they wanted to be able to pass in the same day but it's not possible because you know why because of the dedication level because of the team work because of their intention because we all fight over the boss we belong to the state by now i need to say that is what well, we are going to be able to let's box this to the god not to the customer when we hire the people in our supply chain matters we take a test we are not taking any type of interview no any good decision So any uh, redundancy does it. It just gives a wider spreading to our employees. They will do it there. It first two days he gives the knowledge about the supply chain management and the quality stuff. And on third day we told to our customers, so please argue with this man, is fight with this man. Because without training, how this double order, new double order, he can handle the situation without training. If suppose we use the training, then he will talk immediately. But without training, from what we heard, how we talk with the customer, how we handle the situation, that we want to do today on third day. On fourth day. We punch the device first. So we flag the time. We want to check how we collect forty lunch boxes because every one has to collect forty lunch boxes in just in one hour and thirty minutes. So for hiring one customer, we can give only five seven to eighty seconds. So in eighty seconds, one hour, forty customer, we need flag time. How is it possible? How is how we giving this dedication to collect the lunch boxes within my time? That we check on the fourth day. And on fifth day, we told him you should collect you should collect sixty lunch boxes instead of forty. Work through. What twenty is very important. So each and every part we are checking with our employees, with our suppliers, and with our trustees. For Dabba Walas, their customer are their god. No doubt, the times are changing, and as technologies evolve, we must evolve with it. Change is a constant, and we must accept it. But with people with such mindset and such dedication to their work, if we combine their potential with technology, we can make a better place for everyone. In fact. if you have the right technology then you can change the world but if you have the right people then you can make the world a better place for everyone if you found value in today's video do like this video and share it with your friends and family also do subscribe to this channel stay awesome see you next time